Another day and you're stuck inside. The whole world has stopped and there's nothing you can do but keep your distance and stay in. After weeks, you feel like there's nothing to do and you've reached your breaking point at home. Well, here's how to not go crazy during a pandemic. Number one, make a routine. You want to start making good habits that help you be a better person, so later on you'll thank yourself once you're able to go out again. So that starts with waking up and sleeping at a reasonable time. Write down what you want your day to look like and stick to it. Not sure what to fill your day up with? Well, let's go on to... Number two, finding new hobbies. Now is the perfect time to find new interests and do things you felt like you never had the time to do before. You can't say you don't have enough time because now we really do have all the time to spend. Whether it's learning a new instrument or reading a book. If you're watching the news a lot, take a break from it. Watch something that brings you joy and gives you a break from what's happening, at least for the moment. Number three, working out. Now, not only that, but any physical activity you like, whether you want to build muscle, do some yoga, or meditation. Anything to keep your body moving not only will strengthen your body, but your mind too. That shouldn't stop you from getting your summer body ready. Well, maybe doing it like that will. Number four, practice social distancing. Not only if it's okay to where you live, you should still try to go out even just for 10 minutes to get some fresh air, but keep your distance from one another. Practice staying at least six feet away from each other, but you know, the farther away the better. Last but certainly not least, spend time with your friends and family. Even though we can't be in the same space, you can always FaceTime your friends and be with the family you have with you. Don't take this time for granted. Every day we have people fighting for their lives, and I'm sure especially now, they hope they could be with their families. So take the time to be with yours. Now, you're able to make it through any day of this quarantine. Stay safe, and you know, don't forget to wash your hands.